Hello, children. Very good evening to you all. Omar, you are a new student. Welcome to the class, baby. Hi, Dolly. You are ready for the class? Very good. Manvi. Hi, Manvi. New student, what is your name? Sanraj. Hi, Sanraj. Yogna. Hi, Ishita. Hi, Ishita. Mitran. Hi, Mitran. Vihan. Hi, Vihan. Aditya. Hi, Aditya. Siddhi. Good afternoon. Siddhi. Sanidhya, hi. Nitin, hi. Shruti, hi. Rakshan is eagerly waiting for the class. Hi, Rakshan. Adya, hi, Adya. Mavin, hi. Shashmita, hi, Shashmita. Mithul, Aditya, Tilak, Diya. Very good evening to you all, children. Rishik, good evening. Nitin, Satvika, Priski, Vivin, Jashwin, Mavin, Sanvi. Abhidya, Ashish, Shravani, Tanvi, Toshi, Vihan. Good evening, children. Good evening to you all. Tilak, Megan, Chetan, Abhinav, Iza, Ashika, Jayansh, Pooja, Arshita, Joshna, Zara. So, children, good evening to you all. So, Children, can you tell me which day is today? Can you tell me which day is today, children? Today is? Yes, today is Wednesday. Today is Wednesday. Tomorrow will be? Tomorrow will be? Thursday. Very good. Sanraj, hi Sanraj. Tomorrow will be Thursday. So, children, now can you tell me how many days are there in a week and what are they? There are seven days in a week. Now, can you all show me your seven little fingers? Show me your seven fingers, children. Open your seven fingers. Five here, two here. Total seven. So, there are seven days in a week. And what are they? What are they? They are, they are Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. So total there are seven days in a week. How many days are there in a week, children? There are seven days in a week. Very good. Now can anybody stand up and tell me the days of the week, children? Would you like to say? Okay. Come on. Stand up now. Stand up. Fold your hands. Fold your hands. Very good. Now say. There are seven days in a week. They are. Say loudly. I'll count for you. Come on. Start over. Start from the beginning, children. Come on. Seven days in a week. They are. Very good. So there are seven days in a week. How many of you said the weekdays, children? Raise your hands. How many of you know the weekdays? Wow, very good, children. Good job. Very good. Now, Do you remember this? For those who are not there in the previous class, we did this one in the Monday's class. This is a triangle. And these are the objects which we see around us in triangle shape. Can you point out to the pizza? 
show me where is the pizza here children very good now can you show me where where are the mountains where are the mountains here zaina can you tell me where are the mountains very good here it is now can you point out to a christmas tree joel point out to the christmas tree very good here it is now can you point out the carrot punasmita riya can you point out to the carrot here yes very good here it is krishav can you point out to the woolen cap where is the woolen cap here very good rakshan you are a new student okay rakshan can you point out to the cheese piece here where is the cheese can you find it out please cheese maria zaima gagan yogna miki show me where is the cheese here it is very good now can anybody point out to an ice cream arfa rishi arfa yakshit you joined today very good nitiksha joshika adrita manha aditya can you point out to the ice cream here very good here now can anybody find out where is a uh, mad angles chips did you get that here it is very good akshaj can you point out to the tent nanvika can you point out to the tent very good supreet sufia धार्मिक सिद्धि मानवी मानवी शो मी वेर इज द क्लॉक हाय मानवी यू आर आर मॉर्निंग स्कूल स्टूडेंट नो मानवी शो मी वेर इज द क्लॉक हियर वेरी गुड मानवी सनराज शो मी वेर वेर इज अ डायरेक्शन बोर्ड और अ साइन बोर्ड very good very good children so these are the items around us which are triangle in shape which shape is this one children it's triangle it's triangle inaya triangle here is a purple color triangle a triangle has three sides and three corners this is a triangle now i would like to once discuss quickly with you the different types of dresses we wear every day okay children can you tell me which color dress you are wearing right now i am wearing a black color dress and can you tell me which color dress you are wearing children which color dress you are wearing look at your dress and tell me which color dress is yours those who all are wearing a yellow color dress raise your hands if you are wearing a yellow color dress raise both your hands up right now if you are wearing a yellow color dress raise your hands up if you are wearing a blue color dress then clap your hands if you are wearing a blue color dress 
then clap your hands if you are wearing a yellow color dress raise your hands up if you are wearing a green color dress if you are wearing a green color dress see here green this green if you are wearing a green color dress then pretend as if you are sleeping all greens sleep all yellows raise your hands up all blues clap your hands keep clapping your hands if you are wearing a red color dress then what will you do close your eyes if you are wearing a red color dress close your eyes if you are wearing a red color dress close your eyes okay and and what else which color red green if you are wearing a green color dress then say hooray if you are wearing a green color dress then say hooray okay children fine come on let's all start over okay children if you are wearing green color dress say hooray are you wearing a red color dress are you wearing a blue color dress or are you wearing a yellow color dress black color give me a high five because we both are same same pinch ouch okay children very good these are the different colors now but i would like to tell you something else before i start i would like to tell a short rhyme to you about my red balloon which color balloon is this one children balloon balloon so let's start my red balloon my red balloon flies high flies high flies high flies high flies high flies high i jumped up high to reach the sky but could not reach it why my red balloon my red balloon flies high flies high flies high flies high flies high flies high i jumped up high to reach the sky but could not reach it why my red balloon my red balloon flies high flies high flies high very good children that's a beautiful rhyme today shall we all sing this one more rhyme which is a butterfly rhyme okay come on put your left hand forward like this children come on put your left hand forward like this now put your right hand forward like this lock your thumb fingers and then turn it like this to make a beautiful butterfly what's this this is a butterfly come on let's all sing this song together butterfly butterfly how do you fly butterfly butterfly how do you fly so quick so fast in the blue blue sky so quick so fast in the blue blue sky one more time shall we do this one children come on let's start 
Butterfly, butterfly, how do you fly? Butterfly, butterfly, how do you fly? So quick, so fast in the blue, blue sky. So quick, so fast in the blue, blue sky. Good job. Very good, children. Now, now, I want you all to give a big high five to me. Are you ready? Say yes, ma'am. Say yes, ma'am. All right, come on, start. Uh, okay, let's do something like this. Clap your hands seven times and then a quick high five. You should clap only seven times. Okay, children. Come on, start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Stop. High five. Now let's clap our hands nine times and high five. Yes. Start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Stop. I said only nine. Very good. Now let's clap for 15 times and then high five. Okay, come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and fifteen. Stop. It's only fifteen, I said. Why are you counting forward? Now, let's count eight times fast. Come on, start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Stop. Now let's count four times. Slow. Come on, slowly. One, two, three, four. I said only four times. And a high five. Very good, children. Now, can you roll your hands? Fast, 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 very fast. Now, can you roll your hands slowly, slow, 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 fast, 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 fast. Now, slow, 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 fast, fast, fast again. Slow, 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 slow. Very good, children. Very good. So, fast and slow are the opposite words. Show me what are these. These are the opposite words. Fast and slow are the opposite words. Now, children, can you all show me your happy face? Show me your happy face, children. Happy. Now, can you all show me your sad faces? Thank Aditya, you enjoyed it. Very good. Now, can you all show me your sad faces? So, happy and sad are opposite words. Happy and sad are the opposite words. Okay, children. Now, next. Can you all close your eyes for a while, please? Hey, no peeping. Everybody should close your eyes now. Close your eyes. Now open your eyes. Close and open. Close and open. Close and open. Now listen to my instructions carefully. And you have to perform the action I say. Okay. Okay, children. Come on, everybody. Close your eyes. Open your eyes. Close. Open. Open. Close. Close. Are you performing it in the right way, children? Very good. Open, close. Open, close. 
open and close are also the opposite words open and close are also the opposite words okay open and close are the opposite words now can we all sing a rhyme together on the opposite words children yes let's start over let's all start over open close them open close them give a little clap 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 put it in your lap 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 put it in your lap 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 once again come on open close them open close them give a little clap 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 put it in your lap 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 put it in your lap 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 all right open and close are the opposite words if you really like this rhyme session then hit a like if you like this rhyme hit a like if if you like this session hit a like if you are here online hit a like children i'll show you see like dislike opposite words nice show me like like dislike like dislike opposite words okay can you show me like dislike opposite words okay children if you are really enjoying the session please hit a like button i see almost about 263 parents watching this session but there are nobody are liking my video all right children so for those who are coming to my channel for the first time please subscribe to my channel because i will come live every monday wednesday friday evening 4 pm here okay for those who are coming to my channel for the first time every monday wednesday friday evening 4 pm i will come live okay fine children come on thank you so much for liking thank you thank you thank you did i tell you children these are the golden words what are the golden words please hit a like thank you for liking excuse me will you please listen to me i'm sorry are the magic words we can say them as magic words what are the four magic words sorry excuse me sorry excuse me these are the nice words we can say sorry excuse me sorry excuse me say them every day please and thank you please and thank you these are the nice words we can say please and thank you please and thank you say them every day okay children now can anybody think and tell me when do you say sorry sorry can anybody just tell to your parents parents you please try and encourage to get answers from your kids children when do we say sorry when do we say sorry akshaj you enjoyed the session today everybody enjoyed the session very good say when will you feel sorry tell me children when will you feel sorry why are you not saying tell me when will you feel sorry very good when we do any mistake we feel sorry when we don't complete our homework we have to go and tell teacher i'm sorry ma'am i could not finish my work if you are not doing your homework or if you are not able to do anything which you actually should do you have to say sorry okay when you cannot do the things which you actually should do you have to say sorry when you are not writing your homework or finishing your works then you should say i'm sorry 
if you are not feeling like drinking some milk what what you have to say i'm sorry mommy i don't want to drink okay when you don't want to do or when you could not do or when you do not you have not done something right you have to say i'm sorry when will you say thank you can anybody say <laughs> aditya you say sorry whenever your mom gets angry satviki is telling when do something wrong yes very good okay so when you do something wrong you have to say sorry how many of you will say sorry raise your hands it's a golden word you have to use sorry as much as possible okay when you hurt somebody you should say sorry okay okay children and now can anybody tell me when do you say thank you thank you when we say thank you we say thank you when we get something which we want if mom is giving you a beautiful birthday surprise what do you say oh my god i love you mommy thank you so much isn't it when somebody help you you have to say thank you if there are any friends or your siblings or your parents or your teacher anybody helping you out with your works you have to say thank you when you get help you have to say thank you okay when somebody helps you out with your stuff you should say thank you okay children and when do you say excuse me when do you say excuse me if you want somebody to attend to you or listen to you you just should excuse me or else if you want to interrupt something and ask some permission or anything you have to say excuse me in classroom in classroom you have when ma'am is taking a lecture like this if you want to go to a drink some water then you have to say excuse me ma'am i'm sorry to interrupt you can i please go to drink some water thank you so much ma'am you used all the four magic words haven't you first you have to say excuse me ma'am to break the conversation then you can say ma'am can i please go outside please is a requesting word then your ma'am says okay then you have to say thank you so much and sorry for interrupting your class ma'am all right children you all should know when to use and where to use this magic words all right fine children and one more thing today i would like to introduce a new concept to you can you all tell me can you all do you know the direction words children what are the direction words direction words don't know okay fine listen to me left right forward backward are the four direction words as simple as it is very easy for you to learn okay come on what are the direction words left right forward backward you have not used google maps any time when you wanted to go to a particular location you'll turn on google map right what does it say turn left turn right go straight isn't it so those are the four directions we have left right forward and backward are the direction words all right children come on everybody say left 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 right 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 forward 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 backward 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 forward backward left and right everybody should do the action children now everybody should do the action left right forward backward these are the four direction words what are these children these are the direction words these are the direction words these are the direction words what are these direction words come on aisha tell me what are the direction words satvik left right forward backward 
are the four direction words you also have so many direction words like north east west and all but uh, right now only this much is enough as somebody here are saying upwards and downwards are also the direction words okay you can go upstairs you have to go downstairs all right children left right forward backward upwards downwards left right forward backward upwards downwards all right children now i want you all to stand up from your places children i want you all to stand up from your places fine stand up what happened to you everybody stand up from your places okay stand up from your places okay fine stood no now carefully listen to my instructions and you have to go accordingly okay listen to my instructions come on walk to your words you are left left i i did not come early today every day the class is at 4 o'clock only walk towards your left stop turn to your right side turn to your right and walk forward turn towards your right side children and walk forward now turn back backwards walk backwards now take a left left turn to your left and walk forward turn to your right side and walk forward so these are the nandana hi nandana so these are the direction words okay children these are the direction words okay all right children can you tell me what are the direction words children left right forward backward upwards downwards are the direction words sit down in your places now all of you sit down in your places left right forward and backward are the direction words okay don't forget the direction words all right children now can you please tell me i will show you some pictures and i want you to tell me the beginning monday monday there will be a, a very interesting class so don't miss the class on monday okay my voice is so, so slow i don't think so i think you can uh, you can listen to me rest of the people over here i don't think so my voice is low because i'm really shouting on top of my voice i think there must be some problem in your device ma'am all right fine so here children i am going to turn around all right children come everybody come and sit sit down audible yeah thank you madam thanks for the update all right fine thank you thank you so there must be some problem in your device ma'am you please check all right children so look here now i am going to show you some pictures and i want you to tell the beginning sound did you get me you i want you to say the beginning sound of this one i am not going to show you this one and say a ah. i want you to say the beginning sound of these letters hope you got it right children okay beginning sound of these letters here what is the beginning sound of this picture it's a ah. a ah. 
कैन यू टेल मी द बिगिनिंग साउंड क क कैट बिगिनिंग साउंड ऑफ दिस पिक्चर ब ब बिगिनिंग साउंड यू शुड से द बिगिनिंग साउंड ऑफ द गिवेन वर्ड ओके बिगिनिंग साउंड डोंट से डॉल से ड डॉल बिगिनिंग साउंड ई हियर इट इज ई बिगिनिंग साउंड ऑफ द पिक्चर just air should come out of your lips children okay don't say f it's f beginning sound g g beginning sound beginning sound ha 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 beginning sound is ha beginning sound of this picture here it is i here it is i beginning sound j j j beginning sound is j beginning sound of this picture is k k k beginning sound l as in lion l as in lion beginning sound is l as in lion beginning sound this is very important actually this concept is very important beginning sound of any given picture the child should be able to write down in fact and also say m monkey mango here it is mango beginning sound n n as in nest beginning sound a octopus beginning sound p p peacock p p peacock beginning sound qua qua quill qua qua quill siddesh tell me what is the beginning sound of this siddesh r as in rose r as in rose beginning sound s as in sun beginning sound t t tin t t tin a a umbrella a a umbrella v v van v v van wa wa watermelon wa wa watermelon x x as in xylophone x x as in xylophone yeah yeah yak yeah yeah yak yeah yeah yak z as in zip z as in zip z as in zip over say hi to aiku this is called aiku he is my friend do you know my friend's name is aiku and here he is he is a very good boy do you know why because he listens to all my instructions because he reads every day like this he also writes every day are you a good boy are you a good girl then you also should write and read every day then only i'll become your friend otherwise i am not going to be your friend anymore 
Will you write? Yes. Will you read? Yes. Then I'm your friend. Aiko, shall we be their friends? Yes. Okay, Aiko also wants to be your friend. Say hi to Aiko. Very good. Bye. My children, say bye to Aiko here. Everybody say bye to Aiko. Very good. Now, now we will move on to the next concept. Quickly, I will show you some pictures and I want you to guess the names, okay? I do it every day because uh, that will improve your vocabulary. Not that you don't know them. But quickly, you will be, you should be able to recollect the names and tell me, you know, that's why. Okay, children. So quickly, few of them. Come on, here. Fast. You should be very fast in saying, okay? This is belt. Belt. Knee. 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 What is this? Knee. Knee. Can you tell me what is this, children? Drum. 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 Drums. Okay. Those are called drums. Can you tell me what is this? Hut. Very good. Map. Map. Chair. Chair. Very good. Gold. Gold. Corn. 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 Snail. Snail. Flask. 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 Cheese. 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 Spoon. 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 Fox. 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 Cake. Cake. Mask. 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 Mop. We call this mop. 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 Coat. 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 King. King. Crown. 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 Train. Very good. Children, are you saying? Train. Fan. Fan. Cap. 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 Pan. 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 Tin. 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 Desert. 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 Fig. 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 Boat. 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 Dress. 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 
tap 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 what is this frog 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 teeth and lip teeth and lip yak yak peach peach duck 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 what is this children can you tell me joker joker and this is pig pig hat hat rose rose shirt shirt gate gate tree 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 okay so these are the different word vocabulary you should know okay you should know there are so many cards like this with us see you said only this much this one we will do tomorrow on monday now i would like to once quickly show you the underground vegetables leafy vegetables what are the underground vegetables children beetroot sweet potato radish and garlic these are the underground vegetables okay garlic beetroot radish sweet potato are the underground vegetables can you tell me few gods children pointed god ivy god snake god ridge god are the different gods and children now can you tell me few leafy vegetables fenugreek coriander lettuce broccoli are the leafy vegetables okay children lettuce broccoli coriander fenugreek are the leafy vegetables okay can you tell me the different gods children snake god ivy god ridge god pointed god are the different gods okay children fine can you tell me some marine animals octopus fish lobster lobster stingray stingray can you tell me one uh, reptile reptile chameleon and tortoise are the reptiles okay chameleon turtle are the reptiles all right children and what else do you have what else all done 
that's it so would you like to would you like to listen to one story now yes yes children yes so i would like to tell you a story listen to me okay so once upon a time once upon a time there is a once upon a time there lived a red rose once upon a time there lived a red rose okay what happened to the rose flower first we will see what are the different see children here orchids orchid carnation she is called a florist she is called a florist florist is a person who arranges flowers and decorates it beautifully we call them florist these are the parts of a flower did you see here petal sepal stem and bud are the different parts of a flower petal sepal stem and bud are the different parts of a flower lily dahlia are also different flowers so today i would like to share with you a beautiful story of a red rose how many of you know the story of a red rose let me know children if you already know the story of a red rose now i am going to tell you the story of a red rose so what happened one day do you know what happened one day now come on everybody sit properly fold your hands do you know what happened one day once upon a time there was a red color rose flower okay there was a red rose and that red rose also has two friends and they they are cactus what are their names cactus red rose and cactus are two friends as the rose flower is growing out beautifully the rose became proud of herself saying oh i'm so beautiful i'm the only beautiful flower around here there are nobody who are as beautiful as me so the rose flower started thinking like this and then what happened it looked at the plants around and said the rose i am the only beautiful flower over here looking at the cactus because we all know cactus is a green thorny plant cactus doesn't have any flowers as beautiful as rose then cactus felt so sorry and disappointed by listening to the words of rose flower suddenly what happened summer arrived once there is summer season then there was no water there are nobody to water the rose plant slowly the rose plant started to lean down because the rose plant needs lots and lots of water to be blooming and nice but cactus doesn't need any water because cactus stores water inside the leaves cactus plant stores water inside the cactus leaves unlike rose flower needs lots and lots of water to be lively and fresh then as soon as the summer arrived there is nobody to water the rose plant then the rose plant started to lean down and it requested the cactus plant cactus can you please lend me some water because i am almost going to die there are nobody around who can at least pour me some water then cactus plant thought okay i will help you and cactus plant 
gave water from its stem to the rose plant then the rose plant drank the water and stood up strong what is the moral of the story what is the moral of the story children you should not judge anybody by their appearance now what happened rose flower may be the beautiful flower around but if there is no water then the rose plant is going to die in the same way if the cactus cactus may not look as beautiful as a rose flower but it got lots and lots of water inside that which also helped some plants like rose to stand up what is the moral of the story children sharing is caring you should not judge anybody looking at the appearance we never know they may be so very good natured from inside and what is the third moral of the story children do not be proud of yourself did you get that children you should not be proud of yourself okay you should not be proud of yourself you should not underestimate your friends in the class you also should share here even though the cactus plant even though the cactus plant got lots and lots of discrimination from the rose plant what a uh, rose plant mm, and, uh, the cactus still help the rose flower so that is the nature that is a great nature of the cactus plant so in your classroom when you go to school you should not say if i don't want to talk to that girl look at her how ugly she is or you should not yes don't be over confident you should not be over confident you should not be proud you should not feel over confident you should not underestimate your friends or anything okay children you should be a good natured person you should do friendship with everybody when you go back to school you should not say ew i don't want to talk to you i don't like you or you should not say ew you look so ugly look at me how beautiful i am i don't want to look at you or i don't want you to sit beside me you should not do like this you should not be over confident okay children did you get that right so parents you can use this story as your bedtime story to make them understand that the kids should not be over confident about anything they do because this is a very beautiful story of moral value which a child should know which every child should know because when they are going out to the school they have so many friends around and we keep seeing them saying ki ma i don't like her i don't like this i don't like her i don't want her you should not say like that everybody are your friends you are all one in a classroom you should not have any discrimination in the classroom okay you are all one and you are all friends you never know one day they may help you out when you are in need okay children okay fine all right children so this is the class for today hope you have really enjoyed the story of the proud rose you should not be you should not be very proud or you should not be very adamant you should not be so over confident okay you should be very nice cool and friendly all right children all right you you have to be friends with everybody in your classroom because they are all your friends okay very good children so hope you have really enjoyed the session today i'll see you again in the next class till then please if you have really liked this channel please like this video and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this stay tuned children take care bye if you want me to say the story again after this stream is over you can go back and check the story shashmita enjoyed the session very good story you can go back and check ma dibu hi dibu bye 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 to you children bye everybody jia bye akhilesh also noted very good lukesh is enjoyed very good anvi bharan neha 
Dhanika, you are a new student. Is it so, baby? Every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, 4 p.m., you can see my live. Kavya Kayansh, hi. Kichu, bye, Kichu. Oh, thank you so much, Haniraj, madam. This is your first class. Thank you so much. I'm very happy to hear from you. If you have time, please go back and check all the videos in our channel. I hope you may really like them. And once Omar, you are, this is also your first class, right, Omar? You can join us every evening, 4 p.m. Okay, Omar. Children, that flashcards are very important because that develops your vocabulary. Okay. Kids really enjoyed today, I hope. Thank you so much. Tanvi improved a lot. Thank you so much. Very happy to hear from you all. Shanvi, first class? Then you should go back and check all my other videos. Aisha, yours also is first class. How did you like the class, Aisha? Alina Aisha? When is your next class? Every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 4 p.m. Same time. Every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 4 p.m. I'll come live. Alin Aisha. Hi, Alin Aisha. Did you like the class today? You are first class, right? Anto. Hi, Anto. Shanvi, you enjoyed a lot. Very good. Let me know if you are coming here for the first time. Let me know. Subscribe to our channel, please. Alin and Aisha from Qatar. Oh, oh wow. Second, you are the Madhavi, madam. Can you please tell me your child's name? You are the second class here. You can go back and check my channel. There are so many other videos which is like this. Aditya's cousin is also first class today. Oh, wow. Very good. Hope he liked the class. Anant. Anant. Nitiksha also improved. Thank you so much. I'm so happy to hear from you all that there is so much I could do for your kids. Wagmi also improved a lot. I'm very, very happy. I'm very happy to hear from you all. Saima, you like the story. Very good, ma. Avika is your first class. Okay, Avika, you can go back and check other um, videos also. You may really like it. Atif, you also enjoyed. Very good. Arya, you are a newcomer. How did you like the class today, Arya? Oh, Kayansh learned writing and standing line after looking my video. Very happy to hear. Very good, Kayansh. Ritika, you always enjoy my class. Happy to hear from you. Ni Nihan, you are new to class? Very good. Bye to you all, children. Oh, yesterday you subscribed. Happy to hear. Kavin's is first class. Hi, Kavin. How did you like the class today, Kavin? Did you enjoy? Thank you so much, Fatima, madam. I wish you a very happy Women's Day to you too. Thank you so much. Oh, is it Alin Aisha? You also watched the old videos? Great, great, great. Oh, Debu, you have good improvement in vocabulary schools. I wish you all write these comments in the comment section below because when somebody else looks at it, they feel this is something valued. <laughs> Omar started writing capital letters after looking at my video. Oh my God, great. Happy to hear. Alia, Mariam, you are watching videos from Saudi. Great to hear. Thank you so much. This is first class. Shravanti P. Madam, can you tell me your child's name? 
Anisha Ashish Janita, new students. Hello, children. Hello, I see so many new students. I'll try and improve my upload frequency. I wanted to upload so many videos, but Chirag. Sightwords, I already upload a video. I'll also tell sightwords. Don't worry. Dhiya, you are also watching. Very good, children. So very happy to hear from you all, children. Okay. Bye. 3.4 year, 3.4 months, uh, 3 years, 4 months. 3 years, 4 months. Enough, ma'am. A, B, C, D also you can teach 3 years, 4 months. You can start to teach. Sahasra, hi, Sahasra. I will upload daily routine. Definitely I will upload. Thank you so much, everybody, children. Bye. Take care. See you on Monday again.